the, yeah, the point I was making was that uh, politics is an extremely busy affair. Everyone is constant. It's a 24-7 uh, job. And there should be arrangements within the travel agreements for spouses that they can travel. Um, and the state should pay. No, no. Paid for by the person that wants that to happen. Mm -hmm. Now, as it, as it was at that stage, um, in that particular um, discussion, at that time, it was uh, that I asked in relation to Enterprise Ireland, but there's a policy there of spouses not travelling. So fine, that's okay. Uh, on, on other occasions, um, I think there's one or two other occasions, it was, it, it was grossly exaggerated actually, the whole uh, story about travelling, because she doesn't travel. Uh, and I conduct my political life, um, if you like, supported by a family behind me. Mm. Um, and I think that the whole debate was just taken out of context at the time. And if it ran into another debate about uh, the provision of an office. I didn't ask for an office to be provided. No, no. I didn't have an office when no. I went in there. And the OPW and the Secretary General of that department acknowledged the fact that they provided the office without consultation with me. Mm -hmm. Uh, and I didn't have charge of that budget. That mm -hmm. budget was in the control of the OPW, mm -hmm. Department of Finance, mm -hmm. not me. Mm -hmm. um, and then, of course, you had a whole nonsense about uh, toilet rolls. You know, I, I don't exactly, or toilet tissue, uh, as um, <laughs> the Secretary General talked about. Yeah. That was just more nonsense. What um, kind of toilet tissue do you use? The same as you use over there, <laughs> because as she confirmed on the day, everyone uses the same toilet tissue. Okay. So there you go. That's another yeah. controversy now, is the way. Yeah, no, absolutely, yeah. Um,